through these doors. Presented by First Community Credit Union. Hey there. We're here, here to invite you to join First Community Credit Union. FCCU is the proud partner of the University of North Dakota Athletics. FCCU is here to coach you through every financial play. No turnovers. Only buckets. When you join FCCU, you get the full UND experience. Enjoy our exclusive UND credit and debit cards. So come see why. Life is better with community at First Community Credit Union. For the second straight year, the start of conference play brought North Dakota to Duluth. UND has found success at Amsoil Arena the last few seasons and knew that a strong start to the NCHC campaign was key. Shot from there and a rebound and North Dakota takes the lead. Max Swanson picks up the goal for North Dakota. McLaughlin center for Coach, he scores! Great sight there to pick up Jackson Coons. The wraparound chance is through the crease. It's still free, and they score! Cade Littler puts it in for North Dakota. Schmaltz back the other way for North Dakota, put it on in front, they score! Louis Jamernick kicked it, and it is four to nothing. Back to the point, Livanovich shoots from there, scores! Or did Perron get a piece? Either way, it's 5-0. Near side for Swanson, up top for Weeb, he shoots and scores! 6-0. to 7-3, the final. North Dakota knocks off UMD. Welcome from the port city of Duluth and Amsoil Arena for game two of this NCHC series between UND and Minnesota Duluth. Livanovich has it, sends it near side, put shot in the goal! Cade Littler gets his second of the weekend. One to nothing, North Dakota. Got a return pass, and again, now shoots, and Guyon save, rebound, and Strindon scores to make it two to nothing. The left side, McLaughlin to Livanovich to Berg, shoots, and scores. Boy, is he dangerous from there. And it's three nothing, North Dakota. Comes out to the blue line, Shagabee center, right the side of the net. Oh, what a save by Sefton Filter. File that one into the are you kidding me category. Four to one is the final. North Dakota sweeps UMD. Nodak's veterans and new additions are wasting no time stepping up at the start of the season. With 20 players recording a point through the first nine games, and the most spread out offense statistically since the start of the 2021 season, depth is on display. I think it means anyone can go out there at any time in the game and um, help the team. I think um, every line can defend, every line can um, get an on the four check, um, contribute offensively. I think when you have that, um, you have a lot of confidence as a team. Machine like work, not being able to stop, and everybody doing their job. If you got four lines, six D doing that, it's a pretty hard team to stop. I kind of noticed it in the summer already. Everybody's been working so hard. 
um, just on working on their games overall, defensively, offensively. Everybody can contribute, and I love that uh, everybody's had a piece of it. With practice and being here for a couple months now, I think definitely feel more comfortable, and I think last weekend it sh showed more, but I think um, it was just time over time. I guess being an older guy and having more games on the back end for this team is kind of passing on what I know and what I learned from those guys to these new guys, which has been different experience, but a lot of fun. We have been kind of dealing with injuries a little bit. It, it allows us to uh, you know, put guys in different situations, next man out mentality. So if a guy goes down, we know we have plenty of guys that can step up. You know, a lot of guys are chipping in right now and that's what you need to do. If you can have all four lines getting points and all 60 getting points at that point, you're gonna you're gonna win hockey games, right? It's, it's great to get rewarded. It's fun, it's, it's fun to score goals, but um, like I said, I think our biggest focus is, especially our line, is just uh, being consistent, reliable, focusing on what we need to do. And I think uh, as a result, we just got rewarded, but we just have a mindset. Yeah, I think that's good when you have guys that can step in. For myself, not playing a ton at the start of the season, a couple guys go down or whatever, and just trying to be ready for that moment. That's that's how it is here. You earn every minute you can, and when you get the call, you're ready to go. Or you look at a guy like Montgomery, unbelievable guy, never complain. Got an opportunity to play defense, and he's been outstanding. I think he's on three game point streak or something like that. Playing defense as a forward, right? And he's done an unbelievable job so far. And I mean, we couldn't ask more from him. But I think a lot of guys are hungry. A lot of guys um, want to win. I know as a team, um, trying to get to that next step is a big thing. I think ultimately, when you look at the NHL and the teams that go the furthest and win the Stanley Cup, it's your secondary scoring. It's your depth, like you just said. Depth is ultimately what will win you hockey games, in my opinion. North Dakota returns to the Ralph this weekend, welcoming in defending national champion Denver. Given the team's success against the top-ranked Pioneers last year, it's fueling the roster to keep digging deep. We've seen how important that first goal is for us, and um, getting that first goal just gives the confidence that we had a quick start and we got to keep building off that. We had a couple good starts. Um a couple weeks ago in the Ralph, I think, um, try to replicate that. I think, in my opinion, that's probably one of our biggest rivals, for sure. Uh, I, I, I personally love playing them. I think if we bring our physicality, and I think our skill will take over. I'm just growing up, see how much these two programs win, and I think it's definitely a big weekend. Last weekend's behind us, and we gotta move forward, but we also gotta build off the momentum that we got from that weekend and the confidence we got. When we come out hard and flying, I think uh, we get we get the, the wind in our sails and uh, we can get the momentum going and we score quite a few goals. We had a lot of success in our building against them last year. You kind of think about that a little bit maybe, but not too much, right? And these are the weekends that if you're not ready to play, you probably shouldn't be playing hockey. Presented by First Community Credit Union. Life is better with community.